Oh boy, it's that time of year when summer's transitioning into fall, and one way to help you ease into the cooler weather is delicious food. And our next guest chef, Vanessa Gianfrancesco, is here to help get started with those cozy comfort foods. Chef, thank you for being here. Thanks for having me. Okay, I'm looking at this and I'm seeing squash season. That's right. right? So it is squash time, autumn comfort food is in the air. So here I'm doing my cute little go-to meal, which is a butternut, squ excuse me, spaghetti squash, yeah. which is super simple to make. All you need to do is get these in the oven, roast them. So slice it open, is there anything? Open. You have to remove anything. You need from to here? remove the center, which has little seeds in it. Okay. Salt and pepper, olive oil, upside down on a roasting dish. Okay. Into the oven it goes until when it comes out, you can actually do this with your fork. It's so easy. How easy I remember this doing is. this in the kitchen a while ago. I couldn't believe how easy this is. Isn't it fun? And I mean, the kids will absolutely love yeah. this because they're actually eating out of a bowl, yeah. a natural bowl like this. So look how cute this is. That's fantastic. And it plates up gorgeous. So in the oven, I've got some meatballs, which yes. is going to go with all of this. No, I'm gonna, here, I'm gonna try doing this one. <laughs> yeah, work on the next one, please. Yeah, so people should be able to see if, if Ben can Look do at that. this. Everyone can. Everybody can. Okay, so you've got meatballs. What kind of meatballs are those? Okay, so these here, I'm just gonna place them here. Watch your hands okay. so we don't burn you. So here we've got some beautiful turkey meatballs. Okay. Lean protein, super healthy and delicious. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna plate them straight on here. So they're really cute. Like you're just gonna put two to three per portion. Great. Like so. In here we've got some beautiful tarragon, which is really nice and licorice in flavor. We've got some nice ingredients. Salt, pepper. Yeah. Well, I, I reminded people uh, once before that if you're going to replace ground beef or, or, or pork with something like turkey, then you yes. got to remember it's a different type of meat. It therefore is. Therefore, it requires different spices Absolutely. and different additions to it. So don't make it the way you would make a traditional no, meatball. You got it. I mean, are you a chef? <laughs> no, I'm just... <laughs> that's awesome. I'm this a, is great I'm a, I'm a food advice. enthusiast. <laughs> okay, well, that's awesome. And that's awesome advice also for the turkey meat. Yeah. Also, the consistency is different, so yeah. you want to be very careful with that. Now, I'm just going to ask you to put a little Padmigiano di Giano right on that, please. Yes. And look how gorgeous that plate's up. You've got your meatballs, you've got a beautiful tomato I'm sauce, which this. is simple to make. I'm in there. I'll put this behind you. Getting in here. <laughs> take look bite. how delicious that is. I can take a bite off of this one. And the spaghetti squash acts like here. spaghetti, yeah. right? Here so it's, you're getting that spaghetti meatball without mm. any of the carbohydrates that you normally get with pasta. That's awesome. Is that That's delicious? really, really okay, good. Okay, good. Yeah, I love that. Awesome. But here, so, here's a more... This is a real pasta here. This is a real pasta. Now here we've got a little meat lover's dish. Mm -hmm. We started off with a little bit, perfect, thank yeah. you so much. We've got a little bit of onion, garlic, olive oil. Very simple. We've wilted down some kale, yeah. which you tried before and you loved, right? Yes, indeed. So it's a little heartier than spinach in this dish, yeah, but it's delicious, right? It's a right? great way to, to, to eat kale. A lot of people right. think it's too tough for a salad. Well then Not put, it in, your, put it in, in, a, in a pasta like this, it's right. great. So if you can put in the butternut, excuse me, yes, butternut squash, okay. roasted delicious butternut squash that we put in the oven. Okay. Again, olive oil, salt and pepper till it develops those flavors. Okay. Then we've got a little bit of lemon zest, oh, wow. which is gonna bring this whole dish Jeez, together. Smells good. We've got some rigatoni rigate yep. in here. You can also use ziti for this, whatever you like. We've got some beautiful sausage meat in mm -hmm. here as well, which is gonna give that nice little extra level to this dish. A little bit of the cooking water now. Yes. Okay, so you wanna keep this when you're doing your pasta. Turn this down just a little bit. And you wanna put in the rest of the parmigiano di Yes. This is what's gonna create that creamy sauce. So you've got the cooking liquid, the parmigiano di Giano, and look how beautiful this, this all comes I mean, together. Look, I was already sampling it before you put all this stuff <laughs> in, and it was good. So and I can't wait right? to try this. I'm going to season with a little extra pepper, right. a little extra salt, and you always want to do that right at the end of your dish yes. to make sure you've got enough seasoning in there. All right, chef, here we go. go. I'm going to get a little try bit of up. everything here. One, two. I love to watch people eat. <laughs> how does that taste? Yeah, that's really good. Pretty good, right? Mm, we want a little bit of time left, so let's Okay, go. so here we've got a beautiful pumpkin soup. The recipe's online, so all, for all of the details mm -hmm. on this. And now we're gonna make a little cheesy popcorn to go on top. That's great. A little bit of hot popcorn that just came out of the microwave. Yeah. Very simple. And then you're gonna toss it with parmigiano di Giano. Mm -hmm. It's gonna create a cheesy popcorn. And then right onto the and soup. And then right onto the soup, okay. just like this. Now tell me that's not gonna get your guests excited. It's a excited. great look, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get this raw. <laughs> It's fall. It's fall, it's fall right? in my mouth. Oh, yeah. Chef, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for you having can find me. All these, ooh, that's got good spice. Yeah. You can find all these recipes on our website, yourmorning.ca.